What's going on, Lead Gen Beast? Matty Ice here, Leads for Locals. Got a really cool video for you. I want to share an awesome tool that I found. It's a phone verification or a phone validator uh, tool. Uh, it's called Clear Out Phone. Really, really cool tool. Uh, not only because it uh, validates and verifies your phone numbers to make sure they're actually good phone numbers, uh, it also allows you to segment mobile number or it separates uh, mobile numbers from your landline numbers. This is huge, guys, especially if you're doing uh, a lot of text messages. If you're doing database reactivation, uh, I've talked about that a lot on my channel. It's a really powerful strategy for generating leads, appointments, uh, basically just reactivating your list. I'll have a link down below. You guys can check that out if you want. Or maybe you're buying list and doing mass text messages. This is going to be an awesome tool for you. It's also really cost effective. But here's the thing is when you're sending text messages, like if you're using something like Twilio or LC phone with uh, Go High Level, which is what I use, uh, when you send text messages to landlines, you actually still get charged. Even though the, the text doesn't go through, obviously, you still get charged for that text message. So this is going to save you a pretty decent amount of money over the long run uh, if you're doing like high a high volume of text messages. And it's also going to help protect the reputation of the phone number so that you improve deliverability with your text messages. So make sure you stick to the end. I'm going to show you exactly how this works. It's pretty simple. And I'm going to show you an example of a list that uh, I validated really quick. And uh, yeah, if you want to check it out, I'll have an affiliate link down below. If you don't mind, guys, uh, do go through that affiliate link. Uh, if you want to support the channel and support this content, I would uh, really appreciate it. And uh, hit that uh, thumbs up button as well. It really does help. So first off, uh, let's break down the pricing. So clear out phone. Here we go. Scroll down to the bottom here. And... I think this is pretty cost effective. And I've actually, uh, I've been looking for a phone verification and, and validator uh, tool for a while. And uh, if you're using Go High Level, you can actually validate phone numbers inside of Go High Level. I'll do a separate video on that. Uh, but I like this because you can upload lists into it and it, it validates the list really, really fast. And it segments the mobile from landlines. I'm not sure that Go High Level can do that yet. But um, I've also looked at other tools that are really, really expensive too. And they, they don't allow you to separate the mobile and landline number. So for me, this pricing is absolutely phenomenal for what it does. 5,000 credits, $22 and 50 cents a month. Are you kidding me? That is really, really good. And obviously if you pay annually, you get an even better deal. But <clears throat> for me, this is, uh, this is a pretty cost effective tool to make sure that you are sending text messages to valid phone numbers, to mobile numbers as well. And what it allows you to do too is uh, uh, customize the type of marketing that you're doing based on uh, whether it's a mobile number or a landline. I'll give you some examples here in a second. So let me get this out of the way here. There we go. Okay, so how does this actually work? So let's log into Clear Out Phone. You can see here, I already tested this. You get a hundred free credits when you first start out. So if you just wanna try it really quick, you can do that. So basically what you wanna do, uh, and you can do a single phone number validation here if you want. Obviously, most of us uh, as marketers, we're going to be in business owners, we're going to be using the bulk phone number validation part of it here. But you're going to add your list. So all you do is download your list into a CSV file, make sure that you have a phone number uh, column, heading, whatever. And uh, we click add list and you're just going to upload that CSV file into clear out phone here. And then uh, it's going to take you uh, into the my list tab right here. You can see I already did mine, but over here, once you once you've uploaded it, so here's the name of it too. You can see when it was validated, when you uploaded it, etc. Uh, how many uh, records are in uh, were in the CSV file? But over here on the right, you should see an option to go ahead and validate the list. Uh, I already did mine. Uh, you can see this little graph here it shows how many were valid. Uh, you can also get duplicates, unknown, invalid, all that good stuff, right? So you just download the list once you're done. And then uh, I'll show you here. This is a, a very old list that I bought a long time ago. This is so cool, guys. So over here, now um, it doesn't come with all of this information. Um, it basically gives you back the original CSV file that you uploaded with all the data and whatever. So you don't have to just upload phone numbers. If you have all this other information like name, email, address, and all that other stuff, then you can still upload it. You just need to make sure you have the phone number uh, like right here. You need to have the phone number column. That's all. But it basically gives you back the same exact 
uh, list in, in CSV file, but it adds these additional columns over here. So let's scroll over just a little bit. And this is, I, don't, I love this guys, this is so cool. So first off, you can see immediately which phone numbers are valid and which are invalid. And obviously you probably want to get rid of the invalid numbers. And when I downloaded this, I just uh, upload it into Google Drive, open it as a Google Sheet. I just, that's just what I prefer to use when I'm editing my, uh, my spreadsheets. Now, the first thing that you wanna do is organize or sort your records by uh, the whether they're valid or invalid or not. So if you hover over the column here, and uh, you can see here, you could sort A to Z. So go ahead and do that. And then any invalid records, you just select those rows and get rid of them. Um, and you could maybe, uh, I, I wouldn't say like just delete them, but you know, cause maybe you can use this for a custom audience inside of Facebook or something like that. Maybe, maybe have the address, uh, it's an invalid phone number, but maybe have the address, maybe you could do some direct mail. Uh, I found a really awesome direct mail uh, postcard marketing company. I'll link down below to that video as well if you guys wanna check that out. So um, you don't necessarily wanna delete your leads just because it's an invalid number, depending on the information that you have. But uh, what you do wanna do is segment the list. Now you wanna break the list up into different components. So you could take your invalid records uh, create another spreadsheet. So literally what you could do is just um, duplicate this spreadsheet. Um, you could delete the contacts and then paste over the invalid records. And then maybe you do that direct mail campaign or, you know, you upload them into a custom audience on Facebook, something like that. All right. Now, once you have, uh, and then you, once you have them pasted over into the new worksheet, then go ahead and delete them. Um, <clears throat> because now what we can do so we have our valid phone numbers, but now we want to segment, uh, we want to create a separate list with the mobile numbers uh, in, in the landline numbers, right? So now what we do is in this column right here where it says fixed line or mobile line or uh, toll free, like I already have it organized here uh, or sorted, but you do the same exact thing, sort A to Z, and you're going to uh, copy all of the records that are valid, are, uh, not, not valid, I'm sorry, uh, that are mobile numbers and you create another worksheet here. So you right click, duplicate it, get rid of all the records on the, the new duplicated one, and then paste over all the records that are mobile numbers, and then delete all the mobile, mobile numbers in this spreadsheet. So now you have three separate lists. You have your valid landline numbers, you have your valid mobile numbers, and you have your invalid numbers. And, and from there, you can decide what you wanna do from a marketing standpoint. But this gives you control, uh, much more control and uh, a lot more uh, ability to, to customize a type of marketing campaigns that you're creating here uh, based on what type of phone number it is. So, you know, if you're running a database reactivation campaign, now you can do, do that to uh, and you're doing text messages. That's a big part of database reactivation. You can now use just that part of your list. And then maybe the other part of the list, you have a sales team or maybe you've hired a call center. And now you can do uh, you can use a power dialer, which you can create inside of Go High Level uh, as well. Maybe you you have a call center that you give that list to, and now they're making those outbound calls, or maybe you have a sales team, whatever it is. Uh, uh, maybe you're doing voice drops as well. But at least this way, you're not sending text messages to numbers where it's not going to go through. It's going to uh, hurt the reputation of your phone number, and it costs you money unnecessarily, right? So really, really awesome tool. Uh, one last thing that I'll show you guys that I'm gonna be playing around with is this API capability. So again, if you're doing a high volume lead generation and you want to validate the phone number first, like that's the very first thing that you do before you start sending any text messages, uh, because it has an API capability, you'll be able to do that. You can make that the first part of your automation, have it automate the or uh, not automate, uh, validate the phone number. And then based on whether, uh, again, I, I, I'm gonna be playing around with this. I don't know if we can create an automation based on whether it's a mobile or landline number, but at least you can validate the phone numbers before they come in. So you're not sending you know, uh, stuff to invalid phone numbers, right? So uh, I'm gonna be playing around with the API capability of this as well, uh, which is I'm really excited about, especially with Go High Level because they have that new webhook feature so it, it can integrate with this kind of stuff really, really well. I'll be coming out with some additional videos on that later. So make sure you subscribe and uh, stay in touch. But uh, I think, yeah, that's about it, guys. Uh, I just wanted to share this awesome tool with you. 
And uh, I would really appreciate it if you drop some feedback down in the comments section. Let me know what you think about this. And also, if you have other phone validators that uh, and, and phone verification services that you that you have used that are really good, I'd love to know what those are. Uh, always looking for the best tools to keep crushing our marketing, guys. That's what it's all about. So I hope this was helpful. I hope you guys are crushing it. If you have any questions, drop some comments down below, and I'll see you in the next one. Matty Ice is out. Your success.